explain why some of us seem to catch colds more easily than mm -hmm. others. Hmm, I really want to hear this, right? <laughs> I mean, joining us now to explain it, health anchor Liz Bonus. Keep us healthy, Liz. You know, I have to tell you that I found this fascinating as well. This is really interesting. The common cold has puzzled researchers for years. You know, the joke is we can send a man to the moon and we can't cure the common cold. Why do we get them? What causes them? What can we do to prevent them? Well, now the National Institutes of Health says a new study gives us a possible explanation why some people do appear to get more colds than others and how that may help us learn more to answer a few of these other common cold questions. In this study, researchers found that the cells that line our airways are really good at fighting off and defending against rhinoviruses that cause colds. But apparently, there's a trade-off. When these cells are busy defending against tissue damage due to other things, such as cigarette smoke, pollen, things that pollute our air, we lose the ability to fend off these rhinoviruses and we get more colds. Now think about it, this really does make sense as to why some people do get more colds than others. Now, this time of year, big time for colds, but also allergies. You heard us mention pollen. So you say, I have allergies, but I think I also caught a cold. It's possible. Or some people who smoke will notice they get a lot more colds and respiratory infections. Again, you're competing with the tobacco. It appears we only have so much power in our nasal passages to fend things off and the cold competes with whatever else we're trying to fend off. Isn't that interesting? Good information. Yeah, yeah. it's very interesting. I thought that too. You know, and I have a, a, a family member who lost all his hair at a young age, so even the lining, you know, the hair's in oh, your yeah, nose, yeah, yeah. and he gets a lot of colds because that protects you too. I mean, the things you don't think about, right? I came into the office today and I sneezed. The first thing Liz said, No. Are you sick? Do you have I a cold? Did. I know. I was going to send him home. <laughs> we haven't had that happen yet. We're going to have to negotiate. We did not allow sick people back <laughs> in our little office. Thank right. you, Liz. All right, come